typical weather for us uh, it is pretty rainy out here right now um, I'm just on my way to do a boom operators course so scissor lift genie lift forklift and uh, yeah so I'm doing that today uh, I shouldn't take too long I've already I already have my ticket I just have to go do the actual uh, I guess uh, hands-on part of it so we're gonna go do that today I don't even know how much of filming I'm going to be able to do with that. Um, but I think, yeah, it won't take that long to get that done. And then I'm going to come up with something else to do and we're going to film that. We're just going to film the day and see how it goes. Let's flip to it. <laughs> I just got out of uh, the course <laughs> for uh, booms, uh, scissor lift, forklift, and all that fun stuff. Um, I actually thought it was going to be over like around noon today, and I didn't actually know that I was going for my forklift operators course today. So that happened, and it is now five o'clock and I got in there at 7 30 this morning and I was expecting to be out at 12 in the afternoon so I got absolutely nothing done today and uh, so maybe I will just I was supposed to make a vlog yesterday didn't end up happening but I do have some footage from yesterday so let's throw that in here and let's do that now <laughs> I'm on my way to go get a coffee, feeling like I really need one right now. It's it's kind of funny, I'm just, I'm feeling pretty sore today actually. I haven't been up to a lot, uh, but just today's one of those days where I I'm, I feel sore. I don't, I don't know what's going on, maybe I'm getting a cold or something, but I just feel sore, so. Um, I'm gonna go get a coffee, I'm gonna get my energy for today, and uh, I think me and Wyatt, I'm gonna go teach Wyatt how to stunt drive. Wyatt's a good friend of mine. He works in the film industry as well, stunt man. Um, and he said he's wanted to learn how to drive for a long time and always asked me to do it. So uh, today I thought it'd be p the perfect day to go teach Wyatt how to slide a car around. And uh, yeah, so I think that's the plan for today. Um, I have to get insurance for the Hellcat. It's up right now, so that's gonna be my first task besides getting a coffee. So. I got my coffee, uh, Vente Ice Caramel Macchiato, but the usual, um, and we are at the insurance place, so I'm going to hop in there, get insurance for the car, get this day rolling, let's do this! Um, here, let me get outside real quick, let's just see you do like maybe a few maybe I'll more. Like a, I'll uh, drift around you. Yeah, okay, cool. I'll be centered, please don't hit me. Okay. I'm just kidding. Actually, yeah, no, I'm not kidding, don't hit me. <laughs> <laughs> Big stunt, no adjustment. Big As soon as we got here, we came and tested out the 350, your yeah. 350, and uh, the diff, like, 
It's uh, it doesn't have an LSD in it. It isn't welded or anything, and it's so it just keeps opening. So we can't really uh, okay. drift it. And also the handbrake isn't working. Right, right. So uh, drifting that, it's kind of a no go. And also I don't want to blow his dip up or anything like that. That wouldn't like, be the best thing. Like Drop. Te teaching you guys how to drift or like do anything in that right now, like we would blow it up for sure. So yeah. I just don't want to do that right now. <laughs> yeah, that'd be uh, that'd be no good. Um, I'll let you hold it. Let's do it. So like some people have different techniques of doing uh, J turns I guess or reverse 180s whatever you want to call it So like I like to do a little bump like a little counter steer and then at least it it lines me up Good in the road whereas if you're doing it on a tight road It'll keep you pretty much centered whereas if you just like do like the usual crank the wheel It'll kick you out a little bit sometimes. So if you're doing it on a really narrow road, mm -hmm. sometimes it's not great to do it that way. Okay, so in an automatic vehicle like this, when you're in drive compared to reverse, yeah. So you rip it in reverse. Yeah, rip you it. do the quarter turn on the steering wheel, yeah. and then you flip it back to drive when you counter steer, and that will allow you to continue going in a straight line. Or right exactly, here. if that so, makes any sense at all. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so yes, yeah, so you you start off in reverse. Um, I do a little. I would say quarter turn in okay. the steering wheel and then I do a complete flip 180 on the wheel so counter turn and during that 180 are you switching to drive at the end of it at the end of it okay yeah. so, so you're I, still in reverse while you're doing the 180 turn on the yeah. steering wheel okay okay yeah so then at least you can like turn your wheel back and right. like do whatever you got to do right okay cool So you're driving straight right and on. then you get into like go back into drive once you're done perfect right? perfect just make sure we're going straight back right now yeah Alright, let's do this. Let's see. Woo. <laughs> That's a J turn. That was <laughs> trippy, man. Bring that ass back like a boom boom.